It barely feels like football has taken a short slumber as the nation switched gears from men's football to the women's Euros in a heartbeat. With the Lionesses still yet to finish their campaign, Coventry United begin theirs with a trip to Milton Keynes Irish. A step into the unknown, not just in terms of opposition, but a much changed squad ready to show their worth. Join us live from the Manor Fields as we kick off the new season on CUTV with Liam Cook. It's been a summer of change for the Red and Greens both on and off the pitch with the news coming shortly before kickoff that Michael Kavanagh has taken over as the new club chairman. New permanent manager Ivor Lawson hands his debuts to eight new recruits with another on the bench. Jack Tregarfa returns in goal for Coventry United. Man Mountain centre-back Ed El Hagani joins standing captain Adam Miles at the back with Bales and Clamp either side. No Riley Devoyle today so Kesey and Coleman link up in midfield with Tory Herbert hoping to mark his first United appearance in style up front. Milton Keynes Irish make their United Counties League Southern Premier bow this afternoon at Manor Fields. This is the team they hope will kick off their season in style. Awusu Kairamateng starts in goal behind a back line of Ward, Dummett, Beecher and Gardner. Liam Smith captains the side from midfield and Olu Ojibalamu starts up front. The start of a new season, always an exciting day for any football fan of Coventry United. It is the start of a new era as Tory Herbert gets ready to play the first ball and kick Coventry United's 2022-23 season off here at Manor Fields. Referee checks that the Linos and the goalkeepers are good to go. Checks his watch. And we are underway, Coventry United versus Milton Keynes Irish live here on Coventry United TV. And it's going to be an interesting afternoon of football. Here's the throw, it's poor control. It's put into the air, United have got to deal with this one. And oh, they, the defence didn't, but Jack Tregarfa certainly did. George Boland with his head in his hands. He thought that shot had goal written all over it and uh, even the, the number 10 Dominic Lawless congratulating Jack Tregarfa on an absolute worldie of a save. There was uh, a lot of question marks about who would get the nod in goal today. Would it be Chris Roscoe? Would it be Jack Tregarfa? Well, the former United under 21 goalkeeper is back between the sticks and back in style. But another opportunity there for Boland. This one didn't require the efforts of Tregarfa to keep it out. Smith is an awkward one for Tregarva. Here's headed out at the far post and Tregarva pats it onto the crossbar. So there will be a throw in the Coventry United. Deep into Irish territory. Lofted ball for Herbert. Chests it down. Renato Prifty thinking about the long range spectacular. It's Prifty for the opening goal of the season. Not quite. Ambitious from Prifty, but his ambition. More often than not is rewarded. On that occasion, it was just a little wayward. Coleman preparing for a cross on the right-hand side. That is unless Smith goes for goal. Four green and white shirts in the United Penalty area. And five red ones awaiting what's to come. Smith plays it through for Lawless. Not the most difficult save Tregarva will have to make. But they all count. Bales. Chest control by Nato Prifty to beat Coleman. Still in a battle with the number 20 but finds Kisi. Ajibolami was right behind him. Has to get the ball away. Maybe that pressure from the striker has done the trick as it's away with ball collected by Ward. Now it's with Boland on the left hand side. Taking on Brad Coleman. Boland. Not afraid to try one from range. Trying to steady himself with a strike perhaps. And a deflected effort brought to a safe stop. Pass to Lawless intercepted by Kesey. It's uh, a strong performance in midfield. Now here's Mozaffa can get sprinting at the back line, taking on the centre back. Oh, there's a brilliant save by Kyra Matting. Dummett couldn't stop Sami Mozaffa, but the goalkeeper could. Karen Mateng's kick towards Lawless on the edge of the penalty area, headed away as far as Ollie Coleman. Over the head of Prifty, over the head of Kesey, but Kesey volleys it away on the follow-up. 
Beecher heads it on to the head of his opposite number six, El Hagani. And Beecher loses out to Joseph Agambiade. He's got options left and right. Goes for the right option with Tory Herbert. It's stopped on his knees by Kara Mateng. And that's Milton Keynes playing away, or trying to play away from danger. Smith. The challenge in by Miles gets a piece of the ball, a piece of the man, but not enough to get it away from Oji Balamu, who's checked all the way by Bellsmith. It's a sliding challenge and a great one at that by Adam Miles. But Miles prevented from getting to the loose ball. Challenge in by Bells, taking out Oji Balamu. It's a, a real melee on this right hand corner of the field here at Manor Fields. And not the most graceful attempt at a scissor kick I've ever seen from Ryan Smith. He doesn't get the uh, cleanse of contact as it's collected by Tregartha. And Archie Bales is in need of some assistance. Into the last two minutes, it's still 0-0 between Milton Keynes, Irish and Coventry United. The game has certainly picked up in the uh, last few minutes. Late lunch by Priffley didn't get either the ball or the man. Smith stumbles in the challenge. And now Mozaffa. Herbert wants it played through. Sammy Mozaffa is going to go all alone here. What a run this is by Sammy Mozaffa. All the way to the goalkeeper. Great save. And it's poked in. It's poked in by Riley Kesey. The hard work done by Mozaffa. And it's Kesey who picks up the pieces and picks up the plaudits. Catch him if you can. What a run by Mozaffa. The goalkeeper doing exceptionally well to keep that effort out, but ready to pick up the goal and put Coventry United in front was that man Riley Kesey. Right place, right time, right finish. As far as Coventry United are concerned, the right scoreline. Just a minute before the break, it is Milton Keynes Irish nil, Coventry United 1. Shaheen Ward level with the penalty area with this throw from Milton Keynes Irish. That's about to the 55th minute. Boland. George Boland was back to goal. Can he turn and shoot? It's George Boland. Low and particularly powerful. Tracks it wide at the near post. An effort that George Boland will be particularly happy with. Agambiade making a beeline for the net. Slips it through. Herbert for 2 0. Offside flag's up, it won't count. And that's a real shame for Coventry United. The flag was up before Herbert rounded the keeper and slotted it home. It would have been a great way for Tory Herbert to cap off his Coventry United debut, but not to be on this occasion. Dummett. He's got Beecher to his left if he needs him, but he's going direct. And across to Lawless. Can Lawless bring it down and have a go? Still Dominic Lawless. Three United defenders on him and it was Adam Miles who took it away. And Prifty looking for the run of Mazaffa, but the run wasn't there. Oh, now Hagani could be caught short at the back here. Makes a crucial block and Tregarva with the save. Now Chris Jones saying if Carlsberg did Saturdays. Oh, just... Dribbling past the, uh, the post there from Renato Prifty. That would have been a Carlsberg goal. Milton Keynes are not letting this scoreline lie. Here's Smith. Find Shaheen Ward, probably been the star of the second half of Milton Keynes. Echaki. Some separation from Clamp, didn't find it. But there is some separation between. Milton Keynes in the ball. Coleman. Keep that ball in from going for a throw. Can only find Beecher, but has got some separation from the United and their own goal. And Hagani couldn't bring it down with the header. And this could be it for Milton Keynes Irish. No. Daniel Griffiths pulling it wide. Four minutes of added time to be played here at Manor Fields. And here's Re Renato Prifty being. Uh, Pulled and pushed by uh, North Alachaki. Just shrugs it off. Here's Brian and Love. Slipped it in for Joseph Agambiade. He could have sealed it there. Good save. It's still alive with Herbert. Sliding block made by Ward. 
It's another way by Ward from the throw from Clamp. Smith. Brought down by Lawless. And there's acres of space on the right hand side for Gardner, but closing down on him is Brian and Love. Lawless is going to try one. Anything but flawless from Lawless. It's all over. Coventry United have sealed the three points on opening day. The perfect start to the new era for the Red and Greens. A highly competitive match. Decided by just the one goal, and what a goal it was. Set up beautifully by United's new rapid winger wearing number seven, Samir Muzaffa. And the man who kick-started the move, Riley Keithy, with the interception, ran half the pitch to turn it home. And Jack Tregarva can certainly take a bow to a brilliant performance. Some match-winning saves. And a great way to return to the Red and Greens. Coventry United will be happy with that one. Win number one for Ivor Lawton and his new Coventry United team. Final score at Manorfields on the opening day of the United Counties League Premier Division South season. Milton Keynes Irish nil. Coventry United won.